Keith Lehrman, I uh, live in Mechanicsville, Iowa, and we are planting corn today um, using the Kinsey 3505 planter. So having the 3505 was looking for a planter that was capable of having row shutoffs, down pressure, talked with the engineering team at Kinsey. We ended up coming across this 3505 uh, high speed, um, allowing us to cover almost the same amount of acres that we were with our 12 row, running eight and a half, seven to eight and a half mile an hour. Um, so essentially productivity with me working off the farm, was a priority. How can I get the acres covered in the least amount of time? So having the high speed um, planner was uh, an absolute priority in my mind. It's simple, it's easy to understand, it's easy to work with. Having ran the 2600 with the finger pit pickup on corn and, and brush on, on soybeans, uh, not knowing whether the sprockets were where they needed to be, it was, it was a, always a guess. Now I can sit and look at the monitor and I can understand that I'm putting out 34,000 in my corn. I'm putting out 140,000 in my soybeans. Uh, the high speed, true speed delivers accurate plant spacing. It means so much more and knowing that when I go out and I go to harvest, I'm gonna have a picket fence on my corn. Having the Blue Vantage display, it gives me so much more information, way more information than I had on the, the KPI 3. Now I can look at singulation on half the screen, population on the other. The ability to control what I want to see. So if I want to look at ground contact, I can look at ground contact. Just a quick click of the, the screen and understanding where we're at, what what it, what the planner is doing is so nice. Setting it up, um, this year we did uh, a prescription on our soybeans going across the field. The ability to tell the system that I want 140,000 on my soybeans and then turn it to 160,000 in certain areas. The system, as long as you put that in there, the system's gonna do it. The planner's gonna change. It's gonna know where you're at with the GPS and it's gonna change that. We've raised our best corn in the past two years um, since running this. Um, we've increased our yield uh, 20 to 30 bushel per acre more just by having the, the proper seed spacing um, allowing that, that plant to grow, larger ears, more corn. So again, just in two years, seeing that, um, that goes back to, again, understanding my corn is doing what I want it to do. So with this planter, uh, the capability of raising the front row units. Uh, so again, we're running corn today. So we've got the front row units lifted. They're locked in place. So we're not putting extra wear on the front row units while running uh, in the corn ground. The thing that's really nice about this planter is, again, I had bulk fill where I had 12 row units on the back. I was actually having the dump seed into all of those. You know, if I had a row unit that was giving me fits, I would have to either dump all that seed out of that box into another box and then try and put it back into the box. Um, being able to just go right up to that row unit and then unlock it, tip it up, see where I'm at. If I need to clean a row unit, I could clean that row unit. I could pull that seed tube out with no issue and then put it right back. I'm not picking a box up full of seed to understand why the row unit's not working. Simply closing it back up, it's just a matter of clicking it. The down pressure, I, I set that all in the tractor. Starting to see the production in the fall from the harvest. It just shows that this planter is doing exactly what we wanted it to and getting the 
the, the harvest and the crop that we really wanted. Uh, the planter, again, it's, it's money well spent uh, because we're seeing the return in our harvest. We're putting, we're putting bushels in the bin and it's all because of this planter right here. It's a phenomenal planter. I, I highly recommend this thing. It just, it does its job.